Now let's see how easy doing a mobile transfer out can be. I'll create a new transfer out. I'll select the destination store. We'll send it to store 3 in Fargo. It's time to scan the items that I want to transfer. We'll send three footballs and two soccer balls. Now all I have to do is hit save. It goes ahead and creates transfer number 14. It commits the quantity from stock and uh, sends it out. And now we have transfer number 14, which has been sent to store three. We can look at the issue report for this and see that they uh, ordered three and we sent three. And that's how easy it can be. Now let's see how easy it is to receive a transfer coming in. I'll pick the transfer number 33 from store number 2. Looks like they sent me some footballs, basketballs, and soccer balls. I'll scan the items that I'm receiving. I'll say I'm only receiving two of the footballs and four of the soccer balls. Now when I hit save, it prompts me if I want to close the order. And I'll say no, because there's remaining quantities to be received. It updates the order number 33. And now we can see the quantities have been updated in real time. And if we want to see the partial receipt of that transfer, we can come up here into RMS. Look at the partial receipt. And we can see that we've already received two of the footballs and four of the soccer balls. So everything happens in real time. It's just that easy.